What up, bitches? It's the misanthropic one, aka He Who Hungers, and I'm back up in this bitch for another rant. <sighs> um, Agents of Shield actress Chloe Bennett says she changed her last name <laughs> because Hollywood is racist. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know where to fucking start on here. Um, let me, okay. Chloe Bennett, um, actress on Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. is a show that I frequently watch. I follow it. Uh, it was slow in the beginning. I think this was season four that just ended. Um, started off strong. The season four was probably my favorite because they introduced Ghost Rider into the MCU. I thought he did a great job. They did the Robbie Reyes version, which is the more updated uh, Hispanic uh, version of Ghost Rider um, with, with the muscle car. I thought um, start off great. Um, this, this show is one of the few shows that still does about 22 to 24 episodes, so you get a full fucking season they give you three story arcs per season they're all connect um where they kind of lost me was the last story arc the what if thing because you know it kind of got a little bit too sjw ish and you know I, just go watch it yourself and you'll see exactly what i'm talking about but anyway um not to get sidetracked with that, but I just got to laugh because when people that are considered stars, the elite, have all these claim that they're so fucking oppressed. I mean, I, 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 you know, I just go in, the social critic in me emerges and I just got to read up on shit, especially shit that I, that I know and love like comic books. I do research on this shit and I just come back and I gotta say, my God, it just disappoints me. I guess it, it's really getting to the point where I don't even wanna watch anything anymore because, you know, politics are getting involved. I mean, everyone has, everyone's a, a fucking political activist now. I, I, I don't really do sports as it is, but you know, you see what's going on with that shit. And you know, everyone that's an actor now, you have to think and agree with them. Um, everything's considered social justice. I mean, it, it's just so tiring. That's why I haven't put up videos in, in about a month. I've just been so burnt the fuck out. Um, but here she's saying Hollywood is racist. Um, her real name is Chloe Wang, but she claims <laughs> that she changed it to Chloe Bennett because... Hollywood's fucking racist, okay? I gotta ask, um, how racist is Hollywood when this this chick, and uh, you know what? Let me just say this, very attractive chick. How racist is it when you obviously, number one, you look mixed. Chloe looks mixed. Just by looking in her face, you could tell that she, she's mixed. So, off of visuals alone, people are going to see that. And number two, there have been other Asian um, actresses and actors that haven't changed their name. And they're still prominent to this day. But we could keep it at actresses. We don't have to even go that far. Lucy Liu being one, Kelly Hu being another one, that are prominent Asian actresses so I, I I don't understand what why did you have to change your name and on top of that one of your own uh, cast members who's uh, one of my favorite characters on the show uh, Ming-Na Wen that plays Agent Melinda May 
she didn't change her real name, so how is Hollywood racist? And on top of that, you're you're one of the leads on the show. So at what at what point is Hollywood racist to you? That was your choice to change your fucking your name. I mean, then she goes off on a whole thing because it, it supposedly this started because Ed, uh, I don't know how to say his name, Screen. Uh, this is the guy that played um, Ajax in the Deadpool movie, the villain Ajax, um, because he was cast for a guy, uh, Lieutenant Dai, Dai Miao. Um, I don't know how to say his last name in the new Hellboy and in the book the guy's um, Japanese but they casted this guy to play him and he stepped down and 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 said well you know I, 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 I'm acknowledging that you know there's enough whitewashing going on here so you know I'm leaving it open for someone um, uh, to fill the role uh, essentially someone Japanese to get the role so she went off on a tangent saying yeah see basically she was saying oh yeah he, he's he's being brave he's uh, that's how to fight social injustice and he's cute as fuck and all this I'm just like you know <laughs> you gotta look at that the inner workings of what's going on here number one being a, a a social justice warrior and being a Hollywood star is kind of beneficial to to the star because he look he or she looks good. You know, it's all about looking good. It doesn't matter if it's genuine or not. Most of the time, I believe it's not. I don't believe it's that genuine. But I think because this guy obviously is getting roles. He he's an he's a decent actor. He's getting roles. Hellboy isn't the only script that that was sent to this guy. So he's probably going to get something better. He's probably working on some other shit anyway. So it's like, well, I'll just, you know, sacrifice this and work on something else. So the dude, the dude's getting paid. So stop this bullshit that all of a sudden this guy's so fucking honorable. And uh, it, it just fucking bothers me so much that social justice, like all of a sudden now, they're acting as if this is the first time someone went out of their way. Well, it's not like they went out of their way to say, oh, we're going to cast a white guy on purpose. To, to Maybe there was other Asians that um, possibly tried out for the role, but didn't make the cut. And they said, all right, we'll just give it to this dude. But then he says, oh, no, you know what? No, basically go find an Asian guy. I mean... This is where I fall on the race shit. I don't know if I... I, I got so many videos. Um, but I think I may have mentioned this somewhere along the lines that... Yeah, I believe that they should kind of gear it towards the race of... of you know, even though it's a fictional character. Um, I still believe, yeah, gear it towards that. But if you can't get it, get something... Get someone that, that plays the role. That does it close. Because, I mean, you look at... Um, the late Michael Clark Duncan, who played Kingpin in um, that shitty Daredevil movie back in, what, 2003? He did a great job. Yeah, Kingpin's white in the comic book, but, um, you know, he did a fucking phenomenal job, you know? He shut me up because I was one of, I'm, you know, one of them dudes that like shit to be authentic, but he did do a good job. Um... There's other um, Hemdal from um, Thor is Idris Elba. Hemdal in the comic book is uh, a white dude, white dude with a big beard. What they do? They uh, uh, came back and gave it to him. Did a great job. Uh, let me let me get an example of the reverse. I think what was the uh, Doctor Strange when you put uh, what's her name? Uh, Swinton in as um, the ancient one and then the director had to come and say well yeah you know I didn't want to go the the usual Asian route for the ancient one because you know that you know he, he did explain it he said look you know that, that's kind of predictable you know what I mean and Swinton did a good job 
it, I'll admit it was kind of SJW-ish, but it worked. You know what I mean? But all this shit, it, it, it's just, look, there's no oppression against Asian Americans. That's bullshit. There's no racism or else they would have never casted you in the first fucking place, Chloe. So please just do what you do best. Be, be Daisy um, or Quake on the show. Stop sitting here acting like you're oppressed. Because all this shit where I'm supposed to believe now that all you multi-millionaires are fucking uh, quivering in your room. Uh, saying everything's racist, but I'm a multimillionaire and they're inviting me to do all these interviews, go to Comic Con, I have fans all over the world, and you're pre Stop, cut the bullshit, all right? I'm tired, that's it. Stop mixing social justice with my fucking comic books, all right? And that's all I gotta fucking say. Everybody else, y'all know the deal. Leave your love, leave your hate. Most of all, subscribe, and that's it. Peace, bitches.